All right, boys, so welcome back to the Florida Boys Outdoors channel. So today we're in Bavard County at a little local spot. We're gonna be doing some sheep's head fishing. Uh, we got some nice crabs for bait, some shrimp as well. Um, we got our setups. We're gonna get to it shortly. So we'll see you guys in the next spot. So guys, normally whenever sheep's head fishing, you wanna have a nice little light setup. I have a 2500 Daiwa BG, a Daiwa BG rod. We're gonna be running 25, uh, 20 pound fluorocarbon leader, about three feet of that. It's a little uh, knocker rig with a bead and a small weight. Then we have a size 2 B cook mustad. And then my brother's running the same setup on his old salty pole, so we're going to be using those Rainbow. light setups. And then, yeah, that's what we're going to be using for sheep head today. All right, guys. Hopefully I can get this one on video. Actually catch one on video so you guys don't think that I'm joking. Oh, I'm hung up over here. Give me one second. Can you try to help me out real quick? Oh, there I got it. I got it. I'm unhung now. So we're just gonna throw our bag back out here at the buoy where I've seen it being catching so far. Let it hit bottom. See what happens. Come on, I know we can get one on video. Don't be camera shy, you convicts. A lot of people call them convicts because of the black and white stripes they have on them. Come on, come on. Oh yeah, brother's hooked up. A little baby one. <laughs> Gotta tear through the dinks to get to the big ones. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about though. They fight hard, right? I mean, for, look, that little one put up a little fight on them. <laughs> yeah, they be, by, they be lit by what they call it. All right guys, so I actually wasn't recording, but I actually threw it by that buoy. I caught one. We're going to check if he's size or not. I think he's pretty short, so I'm going to go ahead and actually just toss him back. They got to be 12 inches in the state of Florida. Nice little sheep's head, but he's definitely not of size, so I'm going to toss him back. That's why they call him sheep's head. Look at those teeth. <laughs> Go ahead and get a nice release on that guy. Again, guys, wasn't recording. Hooked up on another one. Another pretty sheep said, as you see right there. Pretty sure he's undersized, so just throw him back. Just not risk it. Yeah. All right, guys, so sheep said fishing right now is not too good, so we're going to just do a little shrimp on the bottom, see what we can pull up. Let's see what happens. Sorry about the background noise, guys. Like I said earlier, we are on a busy, busy bridge. Got something. What we got? What we got? Oh, a little baby sea trout. Look at that. Come on, little guy. Come on. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. He's all over the place. He's all over the place. Come on, little guy. Come on. Oh, man. All right, all right, all right. This guy's being a little, little, little hostile. I think in the state of Florida, this teacher will have to be 15 inches or bigger. He is not 15 inches. He's going to get him unhooked and toss him right back in. I guess we'll toss him back. Yeah. Now, what we're doing right here is just taking these little pieces of shrimp, little pieces of shrimp like that, just throwing them down there and see what bites. All you do is kind of just thread it on the hook, just like that. Just toss it out there. Just let it hit bottom. Give it like one little crank just so you have some tension in line. That's all.
Well, guys, the first plot wasn't too good, so we're gonna head to the next one. So, see you there. So, we're in a little backwater piece of Brevard County. We're gonna be throwing out some three inch uh, NLVNs. We got the pink one with the chartreuse head. We got the white one, uh, the chartreuse one with the white head. We're gonna see what we can pick up on these little guys. Let's just look. Probably catfish. Fucking puffer fish. Gigantic ass puffer fish, bro. <laughs> you hey, recording? Guys, you guys see it? Nice little sea trail on three inch NLBN. Pretty little guy. Get him back. Alright, guys, so the first spot wasn't that great, but it also wasn't terrible. We caught like, like four sheep's head, yeah. three or four sheep's head, a bunch of speckled trout. Tried the best we can. Yeah, but right now the wind picked up really bad. The current's getting pretty bad, so we're actually gonna go grab a bite to eat. Then we're going to drive around, see if we can find a couple more bridges to fish, maybe a couple more spots, and give it a good try. Um, but if, it, if we don't get any more footage, it's probably going to be the end of it. But, yeah. See you yeah. in the next spot, guys. See ya. So, unfortunately, guys, that was the end of it. We, unfortunately, did not get any more footage for you guys. But we did manage to get enough stuff to make a video. And that's what you guys are seeing today. So, I hope you guys did enjoy. And leave a like, comment, subscribe, and thank you.